Hi guys! This is a requested tutorial on how to put the bobbin into the bobbin driver when the bobbin driver is of this model that is underneath the foot there. Let me do a little sharpening there. So when it looks like that, how to put the bobbin in there. Now it comes with this little, I don't know what you call this, shell or, you know, it's metal. Looks like this. On the other side, it looks like this. So, you will need to take your bobbin. I have here a bobbin with white thread and just put it in there, like that. Then, I hope you can see there is a little notch in there. Take the thread and put it in that notch, like that. And then you can see here is this metal plate. Pull it from underneath there like that, so that it exits, exits, sorry, from this um, little slit in there, or whatever you call that, you know? So it comes out from there, like this. Turn it around, holding on to the bobbin, because it can fall off from there, and make sure that your thread goes to the right. So not to the left here, but to the right here, like this. This little, whatever you call this thing, I'm going to go a little, little knobbing. Make sure that points up. And then let's go closer to the sewing machine and let me sharpen the image. There you go. As you can see, there is a little notch over there. Now that is where this little guy will go. So push it in. I hope my hands will let you show. Now it's in there, but I haven't heard a click. Push really hard. There, did you hear that click? Now it's in there. And you can see that this little knobbing, whatever it is, is right here on the notch. Here is the thread that's coming out of it. Then, in order to get this um, thread to come up, what you need to do, you need to have threaded your machine. As you can see, here is my thread. It's the same white thread. And then you will need to use your manual needle, whatever thing you call it, when you move your needle manually. On my machine, it's this upper round thing here. You're going to just, you know, turn that. And watch what happens to this thread underneath. Turn it. Whoops, you see, there's another piece of thread that came there. It's the thread from above. Now you can see that it's crossing our thread from the bobbin. So what you will do, you will find the end of this thread that's coming from your needle and you're going to pull See what happens? Whoa, it's pulling it up. It's magic. Take scissors or something else that you can swipe underneath. Just swipe like this and voila. You have threads coming both from the needle and from above. Oh, sorry, from below. And then you can close that. Now it's ready to be sewn with. I hope this tutorial was easy to see and follow and hope you understood how to do this. Thanks for watching. Bye.